Following the war, some loose ends were left in Cray's championship wrestling. Namely, deciding who the final challenger to Kid Crush's championship would be. After destroying Craven in the most brutal match CCW had ever seen, Poe was named the number one contender, and soon after would clash with Kid Crush for the CCW championship. Lock it up, side headlock. Oh, reverse toss in the back over. Kid Crush up on the shoulders. What's he go? Oh, toss him up. He lost the beating. Duck the clothesline, duck the kick. Oh. Oh. And down goes Bo. Oh. Oh. oh, blocking the kick. Oh. Blocking the kick. Oh. Oh. He caught him. Oh. Oh. screw. Down goes Crush. Oh. And oh. 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 Running head scissors by Kid Crush. Poe is down. Is Kid Crush going to go for another head scissors? Oh. Poe caught him! Dang oh. Tone Stone pile driver spiking on his head! Two. Oh. 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 Kick to the head! Duck the clothesline! Oh. Oh. German suplex! Folding him up! Oh. Gonna go for the Buddha baptized! Yeah. Oh. Wait, oh. Crush! Yeah. He caught it! Yeah. Good Kid Crush fighting out of the Buddha baptized! Night to Remember was voted by CCW fans as Match of the Year for 2004. However, per the stipulation from their loss to RCW, CCW was forced to go on hiatus, and so one final match was booked to close out this era, a triple threat match featuring all three men who were privileged enough to call themselves CCW champion. Yeah, no, it's last match of the year is going to be good.
first, the spine splitter. Zoomed in right in time and CW story would not end here, however, as the eventual collapse of RCW led to the birth of a new era, the underground era. 